morning everybody what a good evening y'all i i was trapped in my pajamas my own clothes betrayed me all right i was sitting there trapped in my pajamas because i thought let me fix my sleeves let me fix my arm sleeves i pulled my arm out i pulled both my stupid little arms out of my stupid little sleeves and then i couldn't put them back in and then i was trapped I was trapped in there <laughs> and I couldn't escape I couldn't escape my PJ prison and I was sitting there like oh my god like what am I gonna do I can't I it wasn't that long like in the grand scheme of things I don't think I was trapped in my PJs that long but it did lasting damage all right the five seconds I was like desperately trying to find where the sleeves were and I'd be like oh my god get my arms in there please um yeah no it did it did lasting irrevocable irrevocable damage and i'm never gonna be the same after that let me say good morning to everybody <laughs> hey, hey, honey, good morning and it's good to see you the peoples are so good aren't they we are re so ready for the dragons he's not crying oh yeah <laughs> We are so ready. There's gonna be dragons and there's gonna be nuts and we're gonna be dragging them all over the place. Again then, again then. Hey, it's Iro. Come on, and let's get this here. Again then, we can. <laughs> Tell me, monster is here. Monster is here. Good afternoon. Let's get this here. I I need to respond to everybody on the Discord. I need to respond to I need to I need to be on Discord. I need to open my Discord. Um, oh Riri, good morning Riri. It's good to see you. Um, what is it called? I have a proposition for you, Master Cena. I think that we should make everybody watch a bad movie. I think after Bad Lagoon, we need not just we don't not necessarily happy movie we must inflict another bad movie upon everybody and i wanted i wanted to strategize with you about what bad movie um we were going to inflict upon everybody my my picks personally were birdemic or stonehenge apocalypse one of the two um i think it's bad movie time again i wonder uh, how many here have t <laughs> seven tv add-ons do i just look like a crazy person writing words like wicked gosh you know i kind of wonder i kind of want to go look at my analytics see how many people are using their computers um on average as opposed to mobile because if everybody is on mobile we already know the answer to that one there's no no seven tv on mobile uh <laughs> Billy gaming good morning and taffy good morning bellamy it's good to see you uh, I am personally am on mobile most of the time, so I can see you be a 90s skateboarder saying wicked all the time. <laughs> wicked, my dudes. Of course, Tabby gets trapped in her own PJs, and it was a terrible experience. It was an awful experience. I would never, I would never wish it upon even my deepest of enemies to be trapped in her own PJs. Oh, Tabby got tiny arms. <laughs> My arms are totally normal, okay? I've got normal sized arms. And I just got stuck there for half a second. Oh, you can use the frosty food out to see the emotes. <gasps> I didn't know this. I'm going to have to I'm gonna have to go download that. You gotta be careful with them PJs. They can be treacherous. Oh no snake. <laughs> Oh my god, that's why. That's why I got stuck. That's why I got trapped. Because it's they're they're, they're treacherous indeed. Slithery, slithery little things. PJs are. I'm in Tavers, I've been up all night because my cats are assholes and now I'm running on fumes and have work in about five hours. Help. Hey, Aaron and good good morning. Uh it sounds like it's nap time. It sounds like it's time to deploy an emergency nap, honestly. It sounds like it's time for uh, for emergency measures. It's either that or caffeine. I, I would personally opt for the nap if I were you. And then the caffeine later, halfway through my shift. It is I, the Riri, hey. Oh, 
bad movie time. Birdemic is a classic, so romantic. The most romantic of bird movies. Um, do we need a bad movie? Why must you wound me so? We need a bad movie. <laughs> you don't even know we need it. <laughs> oh, so you want to switch up the anime movie for Birdemic, are you sure? No, 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 no. I want to keep the anime movie. I want to keep in Blue Lagoon. And then, after Blue Lagoon, um, bad movie time. Bad movie time after that. Oh, wrong. There is 7 TV on mobile. Frosty has a phone app with 7 TV in it. Oh, no, it's known to suggest Green with a Firefly Slayer. <laughs> Birdemic would be good. I have a laundry list of bad movies. Oh, that's sick. That's perfect. I was reading a book on the history of cult classic crappy movies. We'll have to remember the name. Yes! Oh, that sounds amazing. Oh, Tabby, thanks for the cute worm again. Doji, good morning, Doji. It's good to see you. I, I, once again, I need to go on Discord and I need to, I need to act like I, I, I need to go respond to stuff. But, <laughs> Oh, it's no problem, Doji. I'm glad that you like it. I'm glad that you like it. Uh, there is also Wolf Children as an anime. Very family oriented. Very nice. Uh -huh. Oh, nap isn't an option because I can't leave my cats alone for five minutes unless the sun's up. Why? You know, I should have asked. What's up with your cats? What were they doing? As always, this is going to be borked for five seconds. And... Give it a minute, give it a minute, give it a minute. There we go. We're in business. Oh, I have my volume up like 8,000 in my... Excuse me, in my ears. All right, there we go. Perfect. Um, <laughs> You know, what? what is up with your cats? Why are they giving you so much trouble? Oh, there's Dracula 2002. A very cheaply shot Dracula movie. And when I say very cheaply shot... <laughs> Sounds like it's going on the list. Sounds like it's going on the list, Master Cena. Okay, Dracula. <laughs> 200, 2022. Okay. Uh, I watched Tinker Tailor Soldier Spy today and got a bit teary eyed at the bit. At the end of it. Hey, Ethereal, good morning. That was, that was like a big time movie, right? I don't know if it won awards or not, but I know that it was like big, big movie. Lots of stuff happening in it. <clears throat> Excuse me, oh my goodness. It must have been good if it got you to tear up a little bit at the end. Uh, I... <laughs> um, I was happy you watch this bad movies because she can't deal with her own mortality. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, that's why. That is exactly why I watch oh bad God. movies. Yeah, I've got to, you know, we have to, we all have to escape the existential dread somehow. And what better way than to watch truly, truly terrible movies, you know? And now it is, it's my duty as a person of the universe to inflict bad movies upon others. So they too can escape from the horrors of mortality for a short time. Um, hey, <laughs> Damien, good, good evening, it's good to see you. Um, actual gremlin cats can't feed them after midnight. Um, <laughs> werewolf cats. <laughs> One doesn't shut up, and the other doesn't stop climbing shit, and they don't stop beefing with each other. Ah, uh, they're rascals. They're, they're the definition of rascals. Night comes around, and they're like, now is the time for, for violence. Now is the time to act. And by act, they mean commit um, property damage. They must do destruction. They, they crave violence. The moment that the sun goes down and nothing will appease them. But committing the violence themselves. Cat, cats, cats be weird sometimes. I, I, you know, I say that, I say that, but literally when I, the moment that I woke up this morning, one of my dogs was like, oh my God, somebody in the house is awake. Somebody in the house is awake. And like, she followed me around as I was like getting ready for stream and would like, was basically tripping me 
like wagging her tail being like oh my god there's another human awake finally she was using it as an excuse to like go about her morning as if it's not as if it wasn't like 5 a.m i think she's sleeping now <laughs> i'm getting distracted <clears throat> Akira wasn't too bad. It had bikes and racing. It did It did have a little bit of racing. I wanted more bikes, but it did have a little bit. Indeed, bikes and racing. Yes, it definitely had both of those things. And weird psychic kicks in the society breaking down. Oh, Tuffy, good luck. Thank you. Uh, you should put them in blankets like burritos. Ah, onions, right? If you burrito your cats, you might get a moment of peace. Um, you have to you have to swaddle them like babies. If you swaddle them like like crying babies, they might it might convince them to stop. Um, the first time I watched Akira was drunk at a convention at two a.m. Those are optimal viewing conditions. <laughs> I, oh my god. Oh no, I imagine that watching it at 2am drunk at a convention is like being hit with like an, a, by a truck, like emotionally. Like one minute you're fine, everything's going okay, and then the next minute that movie happens to you. And it's like, damn, I was drunk, but I wasn't drunk enough for this. What do you have to say to me? Unwanted possessions and other refuse ultimately find their way here. Okay, what do you mean, unwanted possessions? This phrase is suspicious, my good sir. Um, <laughs> Chad, they don't like that. They are not meant to like it. <laughs> I found the bad movie book. It's called Junk Film, Why Bad Movies Matter. Okay, hold on. Another book for my book list. Junk Film, Why Bad Movies matter because they do they do matter they're the fiber they're an important part of the fiber of the universe I and mean, you have to realize to have a curious movie that inspired anime to come to the west it's golden is that is that what what we have to thank for anime in the west i suppose that i can forgive the depression that it gave me for the gifts that it came afterwards uh, also, Trolls 2 is a great film, similar to Akira. <laughs> I don't believe you. I don't believe you for a second. <laughs> no doubt you were filled with oh my god, I do not believe it at all. At all, at all. <laughs> the pawn guild is to the west. Oh my god, I'm evolving. I was able to tell that, that was a fib. Oh man, next thing you know, I'm gonna be able to spot fibs a mile away. Um, okay, okay, speak as a person with depression and a nurse. Have you tried not being depressed? <laughs> oh my god, you know what? I haven't tried that yet. I haven't tried that yet. You know, maybe, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna try it right now. I'm gonna try it out right now, okay? I'm wor it worked, I'm cured. <laughs> I just had to, I had to try not being depressed, and now, now, and now I'm cured. Now I'm not depressed anymore. Just cheer up, to <laughs> Mare, Kate, Mare, good evening, it's good to see you. I knew it, you're cured. You, you know how to deal with these things. I just, I just had to give it a go. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just wandering around. Cities are the bane of my existence because I just see things that I can walk into. I'm like, ooh, that's a door. And oh boy, this is a wall. With no regard for if I'm supposed to be here or not. Outstanding move to tell yourself to cheer up. <laughs> Bad move are great to show us why great movies are so great exactly we what would we do with with the highs of cinema if we did not experience any lows you know we we need them it's very important to go to a go to a movie theater and experience a bad movie every once in a while or put on a bad movie at home whichever ah uh, 
Oh, a group of bandits took the book. Oh, a booger is talking. Oh, my son! I forgot my sons, my daughters. Daughter, why are you dying? Why are you half dead? We haven't done anything all day long. I've been wandering around the city, and yet, and yet you are half dead. Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh, after watching the room, you will enjoy great acting and writing a lot. Exactly, it'll be like a like a bomb upon your agitated nerves after watching the room. Assuming the room isn't a masterpiece, okay, buddy. <laughs> Damn, all my movies are gonna give Tommy trauma. <laughs> Oh, so, so just to make sure, just to double check, all of your movies are about the same vein as Akira, aren't they? They're like, you know, deep, existential movies, or movies that, you know, inspire some sort of dread. They they deliver dread, is, is the theme. Is that the theme that I should be expecting? I'm... If you've come to an impasse in a quest, try setting it as your priority quest. Okay, fine. Fine, Dragon's Dogma. I'll set things as my priority quest. Uh, troublesome tome. I don't really care about the tome. Upon arriving, you decide to seek further knowledge of the Pawn Legion as you wait for Mercedes to deliver her report. I would love to. We're going to set this as our priority. Okay, and now Booger is giving me information about where I'm supposed to be going. Such a helpful son, helping his mother, so. El Birdemic will show how to act. Assuming Birdemic wasn't snubbed at the Oscars, okay? <laughs> sure, let's put on Angel Egg, why not? I don't feel emotions, so I gotta watch movies like that to have you don't judge me. God. Okay, listen. All right, your ability to watch fine art because you don't you're not going to have an emotion about it or your emotional response will be minimal. You're blessed. Okay? <laughs> blessed. Okay. I'm over here sobbing, crying, carrying on. Going online shopping for coffins because I'm gonna be dead soon. The movie has reminded me that I'm gonna be dead soon So I might as well go buy a coffin, you know, I might as well go write my will I might as well look up uh, Attorneys who can write my will because we're all gonna die anyway. I might as well prepare, you know <laughs> so, <laughs> You're blessed all right Hashtag blessed that you're just gonna be like, oh, okay, you know <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay, that was a good movie. That's fine. And meanwhile, over here, I'm drowning in my fucking tears. <laughs> oh, you should legitimately watch something like Seven Samurai at some point, though. Okay, hold on. I'll write it down. Seven. Ah, uh, Samurai. There we go. Oh, is Dragon's Dogma 2 working stable or running? I don't know. Oh no, this is just one. This is this is just Dragon's Dogma 1. I already know that my computer will melt. My computer will become lava and melt all over the place if I try and run Dragon's Dogma 2 on and I'm not about to push my luck. Uh, oh no, was I going the right way? I might actually be going the right way. Uh, oh, stable-ish, at least for me. I get minor to major frame rate issues after messing with settings a bunch. Ah, I see. Oh, it's not that bad. <laughs> yeah, sure. All right. It's not that bad, he says. It's not that bad. It's, 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 you know, it's, it's, it's enough to get some tears out. It's, it's enough to cry about at the very least. Um, <laughs> you know, even if the coughing shopping, the coffin shopping might, maybe, mayhaps, possibly be hyperbole, the crying part is correct. Uh, a Kurosawa classic. Oh, uh, Seven Samurai. Is that one of those Zen movies? Oh, the real, the real one. Nice. Oh, there is always Birdemic. That one is already on the list. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Birdemic is a better movie in my opinion. You see, I can't even tell if you're telling the 
that's like if that's like an honest opinion or not this is the city's west gate opening on the okay i'm not actually trying to leave N not the west gate we go to a different gate a gate that will lead us to our goals um i downloaded a mod that gave me 70 frames in the city and 120 outside of cities damn than any of the kurosawa movies okay Parentheses. Oh, so uh, movies. Okay. Oh, I didn't notice it is uh, Dragon's Dogma one. Yeah. Oh, Roller Gator. That is the one. Oh, low res textures. Ooh. Oh, about medium to high ones. Ooh, sick. Damn. Sick. Oh, Taffy, are you not yet familiar with the glory that is Birdemic? Oh no, I am. I have watched it at least three times. I've watched it at least three times. It is... I've wa and each, each one of those times, I admit, it was difficult to get through. Each and every one of those times, I was sitting there groaning to myself, thinking this is legitimately painful. But it was worth it every time. You know, it's a gauntlet that one has to put themselves through in order to experience the wonders of, of cinema. Pawn is called Barnaby. I tend to the affairs of the Pawn Guild. Hi, Barnaby. The Guild serves as a place of rest for pawns and as the gate to the Everfall. The Everfall lies beneath Grand Sorin. Ooh. It is a place of great importance to our kind. But for now, let us rejoice in the coming of the Arisen, the light that guides the Legion. Ooh. Okay. I've learned what to do in this quest. All right, okay, okay. Oh, maybe I'm trying to convert you into a person like me to have me trauma. What is, what is that? <laughs> oh my gosh. <clears throat> I have way too many emotions for that. I have way, way too many emotions for that. I am on the opposite end of the spectrum. I have too many emotions. I should probably get rid of some of them, honestly. Um... <laughs> You know, every everything in life probably should not elect a firework-like explosion within my heart. Um, but it it do be like that. It be like that sometimes. It grieves me to burden you, weary from the road as you must be. But I fear trouble brews. Trouble brews. I beg your assistance in this matter. Hear more now. You have my thanks. <laughs> Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, thank Bird God. I thought you were unenlightened. Monos the Hands of Fate is also a nice bad movie. Oh my God, we, we've seen Monos the Hands of Fate and it was terrible. Uh, hello, fellow grown-ups. I have just talked about Eldritch Gods and Video Game Gods to prove a point to a Jehovah's Witness. Well, I am very curious. I am very curious about how how that conversation went. Oh, so hey, you son, good morning. It's good to see you. Oh, we have seen Monos. Well, I suggest to see Monos, and we have seen it. Oh, oh, now Tabby is hooked on bad movies. I have always been hooked on bad movies. Um, I was going down the list forever ago. This was a while ago, technically years ago, I guess. I was watching all of the bad movies in creation according to like a, like some, some list online. I want to say that it was like an IMDb list. Um, of like the worst rated movies or something. I can't quite remember. But yeah, no. I've been at it for a while now. Oh nice, Torgo is my muse. <laughs> Torgo, my king. <laughs> Torgo, the sexiest man alive. Oh my god. Beyond lies the Everfall, an ancient place that sleeps beneath Grand Soren's stones. We pawns have long served as keepers of the entrance to this place. But since the dragon's coming, a strange aura has filled the Everfall. A presence. Ooh, a presence, you say. If it be some omen of evil to come, we cannot allow it to go unchecked. Okay. We're gonna go check on a presence. Change, or some proof of I feel like we need one of those EMF readers. And like UV lights or whatever, if we're checking on a presence. I feel like I need to go down to the catacombs or whatever and be like, hello, presence, if you're here with us, 
Please, Please throw something. Explore the Everfall. Okay. Oh, the game is already saving. I don't need to save. Thank goodness. Um, <laughs> also, I honored the biceps gods yesterday. Let's go! Hell yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Okay, Taffy. I will spoil something in Made in Abyss. Because I forbid you watch it. <laughs> A father in that enemy turns his kids into soup fuel for his own powers? That enemy might be the only enemy that might get a reaction from me. Ah, uh, okay, so the most fucked up of fucked up shit. The most absolutely fucked up of fucked up anime. Oh, man. You know what? I think you're right. I think I, think I am forbidden from watching that anime. I think I like... Um, not sobbing for all of eternity. I think we're gonna put that one in the do not watch forever and ever pile. But Yendo, I see, I see what you're talking about. Only the saddest of things can have an effect upon you. Oh, Troll 2 is a must if you haven't seen it. Bad movie, historic landmark. <laughs> oh, did I already write it down? I haven't wrote it down. Okay, Troll 2. It has been written down. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so I don't know if I have ever told you, but I'm not re religious, but I like religion and the story it has. She told me if you could be immortal without sickness and stuff, would you be? And I told her I do not wish for eternal life, as it doesn't make sense to me, because as Velka said, life is a circle and you were born to die and it is your job to enjoy it before it. Uh, I come for you. As after death, there is nothing. Vilk is a Dark Souls goddess, and I pulled that quote out of my ass. Have I ever told you my two reasons why I exercise so much? Uh, you have not. You have not, but I would love to hear them. Uh, anytime a game puts a pit in front of me, I'm always, I'm always, I always feel some sort of way about it. Not, gather around, children. None of you are allowed to fall into the pit. Do you understand? You must stay close. Do not fall into the pit. It is of the utmost importance. And I'm gonna heal her one more time. Because I don't even know why she's dying. I don't know what the fuck happened to her. We just got here. <laughs> the scariest, the most dangerous thing that came out of here was the bats. Ma'am, could you please? Please? Does it not, does it not heal more? Can you not, like, get full health? All right, then. I tried. I did my best. Fuck it. We keep going. We move forward. Oh, I see a picture of a specific character made from Made of Best in My Days instantly ruined. Ooh. Ooh, damn. Oh, it must truly be bad if it causes your day to be instantly ruined. Oh, she's gonna... <laughs> she, she's gonna fall. I refuse. Look, I'm so far away from the edge. Ooh, okay, they turned out to be alive. Oh no, oh no, they're secretly alive. Where are the arrows coming from? I wasn't expecting there to be an ambush. I'm gonna actually use fire. Oh, check that out. I'm doing damage and everything. Okay! And now, daughter, rise to your feet. The battle is over. Um, <laughs> oh, one, to defend my family and loved ones. And two, because my wife has a phobia of stairs and is scared of going down. So I trained to be able to carry her up and down stairs without getting tired. Ah. I see. I see. I see. That makes sense. This makes sense. Those are just some damn good reasons. I don't watch anime these days. It looks weird and sometimes even repulsive. That is fucking valid, Medic. <laughs> that is a valid freaking opinion to hold. I understand that on a spiritual level. Um, you are correct, honestly. <laughs> You're right and you should say it. Um... Oh, you should always expect ambush. I thought that we were safe. 
Oh, are you gonna go get healed? No? Okay then. Alright, you ran all the way back there. Five seconds too late. Um, absolutely based opinion. Uh, oh, that's my favorite type of bush, an ambush. <laughs> oh, sometimes there isn't an elevator. Ah, uh, I see. What are you seeing? Car, car, caramel. Not, not caramel. Caramel is wrong. Caramel is not is not your name. I totally know your name. It's not caramel. It's dangerously close to being caramel, though. Um. Down the hole. Do it now. Do it. Hey, Marcus. Good morning. Agent of chaos, I see. Absolute fucking agent of chaos. Do it or you get the spins. I'm sorry. Are y'all... Okay, who's gonna help me through the... Okay, listen. Here's the thing. Who's gonna help me through the dungeon if I throw a pawn down there? Huh? If I heed the call of the fucking void and yeet one of my pawns down there, who's gonna help me with the dungeon? It's gonna be me and two of my pawns. And listen, these two, three, three pawns, whoever, the two that are left are not gonna trust me anymore, okay? They're gonna see that I threw one of their pawn brethren down the fucking hole and they're gonna be like, this one over here can't be trusted, okay? They're gonna start plotting and scheming and like not listening to any of my commands anymore because they're gonna be like, She's gonna throw us. She's gonna throw us next. And then where will I be? I'll be down one pawn. I'll have a pawn rebellion on my hands. It does not lead to good things. Uh, I forgot that Taffy wasn't there for the joke last D&D game. I did one of the enemies, kept saying my favorite type of bush is an ambush every time he attacked. I was totally there. And I was awake the whole time, I swear. I was I was giving adult supervision to to the uh what is it called? D and D game. And I was definitely awake the entire time. Um <laughs> Oh my god, what, it, what What? the heck is this? What the heck is this? Are y'all ancient beings? No, I'm not gonna pull it to the I'm not gonna fucking pull it to the fucking Oh my god, they're not gonna live. Um, They're not gonna fucking live. They're not gonna live. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Tavers, you fool. You're never safe. Apparently. Apparently. Oh, do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> the hurt pawn is weak. They need to be freed. Oh, <laughs> you don't need help. You're amazing. <laughs> Lies. Slander. Falsehoods, you tell me. Flattery. Flattery and falsehoods in order to get me to throw one of my precious pawns. Booger. Booger, my child, move away from the move away from the edge, please. Okay. <laughs> and besides that, besides that, which one of my children do I do throw down into this hole? Okay, who's get who would even get thrown? Who the fuck would even get thrown? All right, I would have to choose. And at this point in time, I'm pretty at peace with with all of them. It's not like Rook, you know. I didn't love Rook. I didn't care about Rook. You know, Rook deserved to get thrown into the ocean. Okay. All of all of these pawns, I I would be shit out of luck. You know, if I if I threw one of them down there. Oh, the hurt pawn is weak. They need to be freed. <laughs> they refuse to be healed. Show them your true will. You should learn you'll teach them a valuable lesson about fear. <laughs> others will work harder <sighs> lies okay we don't know that we don't we don't know Listen, <laughs> the <void> calls. <laughs> i will i will say this the void is making sounds there is a sound within this cavern and it is a very strange sound indeed all right 
Um, <laughs> I heard Sienna talking shit about Booger, actually. Oh, did she? Did she? Do you, did, do you know what she said? Did you hear what she said? What, what were you saying? What, what were you saying about Booger? You know Booger's my favorite. Booger is my favorite child. Oh, the healer. The less important one. <laughs> Don't throw anyone. I'm pretty sure you won't survive this place. You need all the help you can get. This place is is tough. Okay, okay. What about this? What about this? What about this? Oh yeah, great. Sienna you know, was talking mad shit. <laughs> what have we told you? There's actually an ocean down there. I would say. I would say that's. You know, I don't hear it. I don't hear the ocean. It would have to be a very silent ocean indeed. Okay, water and stretching. All right, hold on. Ah. And stretching, stretching has happened. Stretching has been achieved. Sienna told uh, that this snake is so small. Why are we listening to a toddler-sized person? Just saying. She talks mad shit about everyone. Teach her a lesson. All right. Okay. How about this? How about this? I go through the dungeon, right? I go through the dungeon with all three pawns. And when it gets time to leave, we're probably going to have to pass through this cavern. I'll be shocked if we don't pass through this cavern. Excuse me, and then at the end, if the void still calls, I I can mayhaps consider sacrificing one of the pawns. All right, but we have to make it through the dungeon first. Dungeon is is the first part. Part one, um, you know, <clears throat> is is getting through this, and then afterwards we can see where we are in terms of heeding the void's call. <laughs> Oh, what a relief. A spin will occur. Unless the demands are met. I think I think my compromise is pretty good. I think my compromise is pretty good. We get to the end. We do what we have to do here. And then after our deeds are done. Um <laughs> Could you fucking imagine if I threw it in the pot? <laughs> Army came out. I would have fucking fucked us up. Ah, I'm being spun. Oh no. <laughs> Sienna actually said that Booger is a sloppy head. Or that he gives sloppy head. I'm not sure. She said that he is disgusting and awful. We should punish her. <laughs> oh my god. You see, that only lends more questions. I only have more questions. Uh, run, run, get away, get away. I'm gonna have to reload. I feel it in my bones. I'm gonna have to reload. Or maybe I'll just die. No, 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 no. Why this one? Ooh, yeah, no, it's probably for the best that I retry that. That was a fucking mess. I'm calling accolades pawns. <laughs> they are pawns. That's that's the name they they go by. That is what they're called, pawns. Although I will say that I like the name accolades a little bit better, because then it sounds fancy. You know, then it sounds like a like we're running a real operation over here. Like ah oh, yes, my accolades. Let us gather. And we shall quest for knowledge together. You know, it sounds more grandiose that way. Oh, Tabby, hi. Hey, Jamie. Good evening. It's good to see you. Uh, the plan? Part one. We sacrifice Sienna because she is awful. Part two. We throw Rook because fuck Rook. <laughs> That's why. For fuck that guy. Part three. We don't throw Booger. He's kind of chill. Part four. We beat the dungeon. One man army style. Part five. Giga Chad music starts playing. Okay, y'all have a whole lot of faith in me to think that we can get to the end of this dungeon without, with, with, with like down one pawn, all right? One of these pawns needs to be a meat shield, all right? 
I know, you know, it's bad. I'm supposed to be taking care of my pawns. I'm supposed to be caring about my pawns. You know, not sacrifice the well-being of my pawns for the greater good. Or whatever. But one of them needs to soak up some damage. So that way the others of us can survive. And, you know, we need, we need, we require all three of them for this to, for this to happen. Oh, so close. Oh, concocted at your service. <laughs> Concocted indeed. Indeed, indeed. And one of those pawns needs to take a really long fall. <laughs> oh my god. We would we would be fucked. Alright, we would be so fucked if one of them took a took a neat little fall right at this moment in time you know sacrifice it's not only about who you sacrifice or what you're sacrificing it's about the timing the timing is incredibly important you know how do we know that the void hungers right this second you know how how do we we, we let, let us hear it together let us lean over and hear the void together I think that it says that it's hungry. Oh, okay. I, I was worried there for a minute that something else went over the edge. Booger, no, please. Oh my god, my heart. Jeez, stop. <laughs> Stay away from the edge. <laughs> oh god, yeah, no. I think I think the void says that it just ate, but it could it could take a snack in five minutes. You know, I think that, um, it says that it'll be hungry in, like, five minutes. Um, I heard the void asking for a menu earlier. <laughs> oh my god, is that so, huh? I was happy, I'm just trying to enhance your gameplay. Doing this dungeon one pawn down would be a bru an exercise in brutality it would be it would be making things a thousand times harder think of the suffering that we would endure you know yeah sure i guess the pond would suffer blah 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 you know the void consuming it odevs you know but also we would suffer uh through the rest of this dungeon and all of the horrors that it contains it would be a horrific experience indeed. If the point probably tips super well, to be honest. You think so? I mean... I don't know. I, I don't know. What if... What if the Void has weird opinions on, like, delivery, delivery drivers slash delivery people? And, like, we hand over, you know, its food, quote-unquote, the pawns, the sacrifice, or whatever, and then it's like... Ah, uh, you didn't really do anything, you know? And then it's like, well, crap, you know? What if they got weird opinions and then we're shut out of luck with money? Why does, why does it look like I'm stalking in the night? Why, why do I walk this way? I walk really funky. Uh, I've never heard of someone say the void didn't tip them after they fell in. <sighs> okay, all right, all right, okay. I suppose that's another thing to consider. Oh, I should sh be trying the freeze spell. Ah! Back up! Back up! Crap! Run! Put space between me and the, the freaking everything that's going on here. Did that do anything? I don't- I don't know if that did shit. Oh, fuck. Um, if you give the boy a cookie, it'll want a real- ritualistic <laughs> sacrifice. With a complimentary chance. I mean, like a meat you know, How is I can- I can deliver chance? on the chance. That's why I say that meat that and can do. is dangerous. Either you glance at her and you and, are and the ritualistic sacrifice. That part's be easy. Because that's how you say that good morning in Guatemala. Oh. And if you are faster than her, she will pull your shirt. Oh, she that's me! Man. Oh, crap. What, what button did I hit? Ah, oh, shit. Crap. Fuck. Okay. 
Okay. Was it this one? Or this one? Or this one? Crap! What the fuck was my hotkey? Um... <laughs> I'm shark <laughs> Okay, that's that's gonna be the chant that happens. When uh, when we're finally able to like do some of the sacrifices, I say some as if there's gonna be more than one. I plan for there to be more to just be the one, unless the void is extra hungry, and I. <laughs> If you give the boy a cookie, it gives a cookie back. I I feel doubt about about this. What's that? What the fuck? Was my hotkey? Why why is my hotkey this? Why why do I do this? Okay, give me like two sec. This is stupid. This is this is stupid. Okay, give me two seconds to figure out what the fuck my settings are. Ah, uh, no, over here. Here I am. Bobo the hotkey fool. Going through my hotkeys. Being like, how do I make my head normal again? <laughs> what is this a hotkey for? Okay, not this. Not that. Okay, okay. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, good. We're good. We're good. We're good. There, perfect. Okay, but can we obtain fish? Where's my fish obtained? <laughs> oh my god. I mean, listen. We need to see. I'm going to save the fish obtained for for an optimal fish obtained moment, you know? Fish obtained needs to be needs to be needs to be put away for like a special time you know fish obtained it's like champagne you know you only break out the champagne during special occasions i'm pretty sure i heard her promise that she would sacrifice all three pawns and then jump in her soul <laughs> you know it isn't stupid feeding the void <sighs> oh my god doubt big doubt huge doubt what do you mean hide something I don't think the only- I think the only thing that it's hiding is unnecessary suffering. There we go. Um, <laughs> careful with your hotkeys, don't burn yourself. Oh really, that's curious because I heard the same. Oh, actively encouraging by removing the fish of taste. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, you're correct. Oh god. Yeah, no, maybe I should add fish obtained because then it'll I'll be safe for a little while longer All right, okay in during the hour mark. I'll put in fish obtained again Just for you know For my own sake Um, oh honestly that tall palm probably not enough calorie intake to <laughs> Is enough to satisfy the void for a while? <sighs> My my favorite, my favorite pawn. I could never sacrifice my favorite pawn, not in a million years. Let me heal everybody. Stay still. Stay still and let me heal, heal you. There we go. Good, perfect, perfect, good, good. Yes, yes, good. Um, uh, the masses win once again. The revolution is going crazy. Oh my god. You know, I'm playing the long game. I might have I might have lost the battle, but I shall win the war. This will go well for me. Um, you know, for for future prospects, rusted plate. Ew, why am I picking up trash? Why the heck am I picking up trash? Oh, don't add fish obtained, then see what happens, because something will happen. This is not a threat, it's a promise! <laughs> oh 
Marcus oh plays stuff gifted oh a tier God. one sub to oh Xenix5. This is their first Marcus, gift sub in the channel. Thank you so much for gifting that sub. I appreciate it. Little agent of chaos you are. Complete gremlin. Um, <laughs> okay, idea. Throw one. Throw one. I refuse to throw any of my pawns until the deed, until all of the deeds that I have to do here are completed. Until they are done. You know, I'm hoping that I'm supposed to be fighting this thing. I'm- Ooh! Ooh boy, he was- he's angry! Oh my god! into throwing one of my pawns, okay? I am unbribable. I will not. I will- I- what if I say please then? I mean, please- please has a higher chance of working. Oh. <laughs> I love how y'all are attacking this at all angles. We've got, we've got the physical, the physical discomfort, the physical torture being spent. We've got the quote-unquote promises that are most certainly threats. We've got the bribery. We, we've, <laughs> we have covered, we have covered everything. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you to throw a pawn. I'm just implying that Sienna looks very aerodynamic. <laughs> If I was going to throw a pawn, it, it wouldn't be right now. It, it wouldn't be right right now. I, <laughs> he's right through too. <laughs> oh my god, I can't. Oh god, Alucard, good morning. It's so good to see you. And JH, good morning. It's good to see you too. Marcus. <laughs> Another five subs. <laughs> I I refuse to heed the call of the void. All right, I continue to not heed the call of the void. I continue to believe that self-preservation is is what I need in this moment in time. I think. Wait, what if I? Oh, okay. And then he's running away, and now he's running away. Get back here. Fuck. <laughs> okay, Tabby, please, Lord Sn Tabby of Snakes, I won't redeem the oo when I get the points. If you teach me an aerodynamic lesson with Sienna and the Void, doubt, big doubt, big huge doubt, unbelievable doubt. You think I would believe? You think I would believe for even a moment, for even a even a scant second, that you would save for? I think probably months at this point. Months of saving and using your points conservatively. To not, to not deem the Ulu. I refuse to believe that. Absolutely, I would be a fool to believe that. Hi, hi, hey, ALJ. <laughs> good morning, it's, good evening, it's good to see ya. I was scared. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm alive! Holy shit, I thought that I was dead. Oh my god. Easy mode is insane. I was just standing there. 
I was literally just standing there freaking out and I didn't die. Get over here. Crap. Um, <laughs> the ocean needs to preserve itself and sustain hunger. They're consuming ponds. It's just a little water guy. Just a little hungry. You feed the little guy. <laughs> well, Sienna just died. No. Who, who am I going to sacrifice if we need to do a sacrifice now? Ah, oh, crap. I hope that that was... I hope that I hit the correct one. Yeah, no, I did. Okay, good. Um, <laughs> I mean, promise to not do it when I get the points. I didn't say anything about a year later. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god. And I'm going to lobby my government representatives to have them pressure tap me into throwing one. <laughs> oh, spin time. <laughs> The ocean is hungry. It needs a snack. It's probably funded expense. Oh my god, I read it. I just couldn't stand to be here. After learning taffy, ban the M word marshmallow. S'mores are so nice. Why does taffy deny us our joy? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. Let's see. Things aren't, I will admit, things aren't going well for for me in, in this pit thing. You know, thing, times are tough in the pit. Dark times in the pit. Dark times in the pit, indeed. Um, die the second second time that I died. And you know what? Sacrificing things to the pit is looking kind of appealing at this moment in time because things aren't going well. Maybe a sacrifice is needed in order to get to the end of the dungeon. Maybe the dungeon demands blood and bone in order to allow us to get to the end. Oh, man. A time to throw booger? Oh, that was your friend dying, not you, while you stood there and did nothing. <laughs> oh no! I was panicking, that's why. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. I was panicking. Happy, it's me, the void, one of the pawns look tasty, and I'm quite hungry. I'll make this dungeon easier if you spare just a morsel of a pawn. That's the void, huh? The void is making some good points. You know, maybe things would be easier. It, maybe things would be easier if I just threw one of them down there. Um. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh. Why is my nose being so stupid this morning? Uh. <laughs> Find Rook and bully him. Take his lunch money. Sienna just died. We throw Rook now. Fuck that guy. We sacrifice the Rook. Look what you have done, Sienna. Now we have to kill Rook. All your fault. Oh, pit. Sacrifice arms. It's the armpit. <laughs> Top tier pun. Um. <laughs> <laughs> what if you discover a faster way down by throwing a pawn down? I think then I think the sacrifice would be would be good. You know, it would be warranted if if we managed to find a quicker way down by, you know, one of them taking one for the team. Um <laughs> Wow, the void makes a pretty good point. <laughs> I have this guy in my job that we call we will call him David. He's constantly doing innuendos and jokes at girls, not the high high books ego dicks that we do here straight up saying very disgusting things. I found the second person I want out of my team. Yeah. Where do these men crawl out of? I swear to god. What sort of gross gunk covered cave do they crawl out of and approach women in this way? Uh, ridiculous behavior. Barbaric behavior. Don't understand it. Oh wow, the void is convincing you. Believe it now. <laughs> Pawns are like torches, flares. Listen to how many things they hit on the way to see any paths. Oh, you suddenly want to throw a pawn into the void. I so <laughs> So 
hands. You suddenly want to throw your pawn into the void. You suddenly can't stop thinking about the void. You couldn't suddenly really think that throwing a pawn into the void is so good. You think it is a good idea. Listen to me. Listen to my voice. You think it is a good idea. <laughs> what sort of ridiculous nonsense? <laughs> Oh, Tabby, if you want to block your nose from leaking, just put something else like, uh, like a napkin. <laughs> oh my god, is that how it works, huh? I think that might be a temporary fix. I think it's temporary. I think after a while, mucus is the least of your worries. You know? I think that after a while, you have to worry about getting nosebleeds. Temporary fix, temporary fix. Oh, wah, wah. oh man, ew. <laughs> oh, why are you making fun of my home? <laughs> what? The void? Is the void your home? Is. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now I'm imagining you sitting in the middle of the void, like sitting at the bottom, being like, throw something down here. <laughs> I don't even know if that's what you were referring to. Hear me, my child. The void is calling me. I will carry sugary sustenance. I'm barking and the carry calories. Oh my god. Call me a hoe, Lexiana. <laughs> no! No! Absolutely not. I will not be throwing Sienna down there. I refuse. Okay, I refuse. Uh, oh no, the gun covered hole, but we can call it the void, sure. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. I didn't, I did not, I didn't realize you were telling you about the gun covered hole. <laughs> Oh, that's the city I live on. We're disgusting people. They are in the past century. Hey, Zichi. Good morning. It's good to see you. I believe in positive affirmations. You want to throw a pawn into the void right now. It would make you happy. <laughs> okay, hold on. As promised, I'm turning on stupid fish obtained. I don't know why y'all like this so much. It literally just says fish obtained. It doesn't do shit else. It is... Boring. Okay, there we go. And then... Hold on. I need to... Oh, that's why. Okay. And then make this. And... I've got this. And this. And that. Uh, heads up, this is probably gonna be loud. Just a warning. Uh, that? Okay. And then lower it by quite a bit, so that way nobody's ears get blasted with fish obtained. Alright, we're good. We're in the money now. Perfect. Um, ah. Uh, oh my gosh, I believe these men come from the teachings of many previous generations of men. Ugh. Ugh, just gross behavior. Just, ugh. I believe, oh. <laughs> oh. Why are we calling Sienna? Oh. Yeah, no, we don't we don't need to. We don't need to be doing all that. Oh, because she was talking shit about Tabby and Booger. Oh, fish obtained. Fish gaming. Fish obtained. Wicked. I cannot obtain fish. Fish obtained. Fish keys are better than fish obtained, though. Oh my god. I don't I don't understand. I don't understand, y'all. Oh boy. Okay. Alright. Ooh. Let me, I've moved everything in the name of getting to fish obtained. All right, there we go. <clears throat> and then, okay, good, 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 good. And now we move forward. Down, down to the void. Further we go. Oh, not this shit again. Ah, please, enough of the bones. Why? Why so many of them? Oh, she just punched the mic? Ah, it's fine. It all will be fine. It's just a little bit of a boop. <sighs> uh, by the way, Shafi, where are my keys? What keys? What are you talking about? What keys are you referring to? 
Okay, you hold the creature. I need to make sure the booger lives. Stand, stand, my son, stand. Oh, I do not have keys to look at. I feel empty without my keys. Y'all don't need keys, all right? Y'all, y'all don't need keys. The keys, one time thing. I refuse to have keys as a permanent fixture stream. I absolutely refuse. Um, <laughs> oh, give keys? The keys you get when you throw a pawn into the hole. <laughs> oh, booger. No, my brother. <laughs> oh, <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we get keys. Then when we throw a pawn, count me in. Oh, no keys, no keys. Zero keys. Y'all be, will be fine without the keys. Uh, no keys, life is miserable and lonely. Y'all will, y'all will live without the keys, it'll be fine. In fact, life might be better without the keys, even. I know, it's wild. Um... <laughs> Marcus plays stuff oh. gifted a tier one sub to JXHVCDNHXGFB. <laughs> they have given 12 it. gift subs in the channel. Uh, but the keys are the key to a good stream. Oh, this isn't for the void fun. I just like to. <laughs> hey, it's me. Did you ever know it's my biggest dream to get yeah, through Jade's into the pretty. void? Yeah, Jade is pretty. Please. Uh, oh, it's me. Did you know it's my biggest dream to get through in the void? Please. God, is that is this true, my son? Do you wish to be thrown into the void? Is is that is that what you wish for? Is is this what is this what you yearn for, my son? To be thrown down to the void? You wish to be a sacrifice? You can aim higher, my son. You can have goals and aspirations beyond falling down into a hole and letting gravity take you. You are too much like your mother. I too have fallen down many a hole, and it is not, it is not nearly as exciting as you would think that it would be. Okay, it's not even healing him. He's just wounded. He's not being healed. Fuck. Um. <laughs> wow, he sounds legit. He was really wounded. <laughs> oh, Sienna. Oh my gosh. All of y'all are like Booger or Sienna. Nobody, nobody seems to think that. Um. Car caramel caramel should be thrown down into the pit no one no one has elected her as tribute to, to the void oh my gosh if I spent all points I obtain on the stream fund so others can go for our true goal oh. of the real <laughs> Oh, oh, thank you so much for the follow. That is fire. I appreciate it. Uh, you're better off healing during battle before they get hurt too badly. Okay, so once the damage is done, it's done. Like, they, um, examine? Fish obtained. <laughs> Fish obtained. Oh my freaking god. Oh god, what was he talking about? Oh yeah, no, no. Once the once the damage is done, we're kind of fucked. For um, for the frickin'. Oh my gosh, for healing and battles and shit. Oh hi, thank you for giving me a sub. Hey, satisfier. Come on, and it's nice to meet you. Um. <laughs> Karma would give the void indigestion. Karma is tasty. But Sienna is farming equipment. Y'all! Y'all, listen to me. Y'all, y'all need to talk about woman respectfully. Alright? I swear to God. We, I was just talking. <laughs> y'all! I fucking swear. Oh my God. <laughs> fish oh hello <laughs> we want some ponds to be thrown i have i told you oh god this is totally legit um telling how cute you are today and it was has nothing to do with the pond throwing at all but it is working for you to throw sienna <laughs> 
What sort of cursed, horrific Riz? That is that is the most nightmare-inducing Riz I've ever seen in my life. That is some truly nightmarish, scary. Listen, all I'm saying, if if I had somebody shoot that Riz at me, IRL, I think I would cry. I think at that point it would be time to cry. Oh, Sienna insults the others. Must be next sacrifice tribute. I mean, the Pit of Darkness charity on donation. <laughs> There's so many of them. Why are there so many of them? Ah, oh, crap. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, he can't be healed while he's on the ground. Stand. Stand and, and be healed. And get back in there. Go on, I believe in you. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Can we risk you by throwing a seal? <laughs> Can we risk Booger and ask you to throw it? <laughs> Yo! Please, 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 please! <laughs> Pretty please! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, please, we're begging on hands and knees! <laughs> Out. You work so well, so next time we see you in the street and go, yeah, that girl works pretty well. And I learned through a pawn. Please throw a pawn. Oh my god. Listen, look at how our pawns are dying. Look at how our pawns are dying. We need all three of them, at least until the very end. You know, later, when things aren't so dire. You know, okay, oh please! <laughs> okay, okay, yes. Okay, yes, I will throw a pawn, okay? I will throw one of the pawns into the void. We will have a whole ceremony dedicated to throwing one of the pawns into the void. But first... <laughs> You need, you need, <laughs> you need, we need to wait until we get to the end, okay? We need to wait until we get to the end. And then when we're coming back up, then we can throw one of them. We can throw one of them in. Oh my gosh. Um... <laughs> I'm just saying, Taffy, I have heard that if you throw pawns to the void, you are cured from IBS. Oh my god, I don't know. I don't know. It's It feels like one of those one of those scams. Every, you know, everywhere you look, there's somebody who claims that they can cure you of your IBS. And then, and then you see the plane, you try it out, and it never goes well. Um, <laughs> we, but we want McDonald's now. <laughs> All three. There is Booger, Caramel, and you. That is three. Sienna is useless for your own logic. Oh, this is so sad. Pawn sacrifice. We can sacrifice our pawns later. All right. It's 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 just a little bit of. You know, we're we're delaying the gratification of sacrificing one of the pawns until later. This is okay. This is good. Um. This is, this is correct, even. Seems it's controlled by another device. Oh uh, yeah, what other devices is it controlled by? Oh, Tabby, I do not think you'll have an opportunity to throw a pawn once you get to the end. I see. Okay, y'all know something. Y'all know something that I don't. Oh, we will get pawn sacrifice later. <laughs> Wrong evil. <laughs> oh man, okay, so something happens. Later on. And we don't get the opportunity to sacrifice a pawn. Oh, you said later 20 miles ago? <laughs> yeah, and we're still not at the end. And we're still not at the end of the dungeon. So, you know, a throwaway pawn and next pizza delivery free. Terms and conditions apply. Each sends of us pizza and pay for shipping, so it's free. I don't think- I don't think any of my attacks are doing anything. Quickly, 
I don't think. Yeah, no, I don't think it. Oh no! No, where are you going? What are you doing? Stop trying to eat her! Put her down! There we go. No! No! Crap! Shit! No! Fuck no! I'll pull over the car, please, please, please! We want pawn sacrifice for dinner! <laughs> I'm not implying that you won't get the opportunity to come back for any particular reason at all. Don't worry about it, but you may want to sacrifice it now, before it's too late. Oh my gosh, also Marcus isn't staying on his side of the car. <laughs> You're a magic user, your attacks aren't supposed to do anything. Oh shit, I'm alive. I thought I was dead. I thought I was dead. Holy fuck, I thought I was dead. Okay, let me... Oh, okay. All right, and then I've got... I've got Booger. All right. There we go. Um... Like, I'm throwing fire at it, and it's, like, laughing at me, throwing fire at it. Maybe I'm supposed to run away. Maybe I'm supposed to run away from it. Maybe fighting it is stupid. Um... <laughs> Oh, tell him to stop there. You had my side. <laughs> oh, see, even the troll. Um, think she is she is yummy and yummy and nutritional. Throw her into the boy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, okay, hold on. Oh no, 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 no. Yeah, and I'm just running, and maybe I'll find safety if I just keep running and don't look back. Um, also, I lost the stylus in the seat. I told y'all not to lose your stylus, alright? I told y'all to wear the stupid little stylus strap, so that way y'all don't lose it. You need to wear the stylus strap on your wrist, so you don't lose your stylus. <sighs> Crap. God damn. Um... <laughs> Oh, you're supposed to support the actual fighters. Oh my god, alright, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Can I swap out my pawns, actually? Hold on, I want to do something, I want to try something. I'm going back up. I'm getting out of here for five seconds. I want to check out something really quickly. Um... <laughs> Oh, the game is trolling you for not sacrificing your soldiers to the void. Oh, Taffy, Tyro, and Marcus are fighting again. I cannot sleep. How long until we arrive? <laughs> it's at least 20 minutes. It's at least 20 minutes until we arrive. Just ignore them. Just ignore them. It's fine. Oh, just leave my Pokemon in the box. Then don't use my Pokemon for nothing. <laughs> well, this is successful. Oh, yeah. If they sucked, I renamed them and got rid of the dumb orange dragon. Uh, if you're gonna swap out the pawn, you might as well throw one. I wanna... I wanna... Oh my god. Oh, there's spiders. Look at all these dogs. Check out that dog. Oh, the dog's angry. The dog's feral. Shit. Um... <laughs> I'm throwing them is a pretty fast way of dismissing them. Oh shit, it is, isn't it? I guess that's true. I guess that's true. I can I can't dismiss them. Okay, well now I'm gonna get to the Okay, this is about as far as I can go. Before I have to turn all the way back. Alright. Uh we need ritual music. Oh look at them chickens. Actually the fast swap is throwing them to the void. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Let me, let me see. I'm going to type it into the Google ritual music and I'm going to see what they give us. Okay, so I'm going to go to the YouTube. I'm going to type in ritual. Mm, it's going to give me something weird. It's going to give me some freaky shit. Music. Uh, no, not quite like that. Occult ritual music. Okay, I'm gonna click on it. Has anybody used it for occult reasons? Is this secretly something that I don't know about? Folding laundry at 4 a.m. has never been menacing, says one one commenter. Alright. 
and let me make it so that way y'all can hear it. Um, <laughs> bring out the ceremony on jangling keys. Guys, prepare for the ritual. Why did I write this? Hey, Moon. Good evening, Moon. It's good to see ya. Alright, hold on. It might be loud and I might need to fix it. There we go. Yeah. Hopefully... Let me put the limiter on it, so that way I can... Don't quite have to worry about that so much. Okay. Yes. And then put that all the way down. And then hire it. Until it is perfection. Alright, I think that we're good. How are we doing on the, on the sound? Is it too loud or is it too low? Um, <laughs> it's a nice song, totally unrelated to Sacrifice. Oh yeah. Are we requesting songs? Oh, Shank Bane, <laughs> feeding time. Oh, Taffy, you know what to do. <gasps> Nambo number five for Sacrifice. <laughs> you know which song to add to the track list. The unofficial theme of your channel. <laughs> You're so correct. Okay, hold on. What was I thinking? Typing in ritual music. Mambo number five. <laughs> okay, I need, I'm need. i going to use the karaoke version so that way I don't need to eat my VOD, alright? Ugh, alright. And then... Go to where it says settings. And playback speed. <laughs> that's too low. There we go. That's perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. <laughs> A song that could describe your entire playlist. Bellamy, you're so correct. <laughs> Sounds like Nine Inch Nails. God, we have to do small dialogue for the sacrifice we do. Okay, everybody. Um, <laughs> such a goofball. Everybody. It is time for the pawn sacrifices. The time for pawn sacrifice is at hand. Our journeys through the... Oh my God, the song. <laughs> Our journeys. <laughs> through through this dungeon have been perilous and non-fruitful. Our journeys have not bore fruit. Instead, they have bore only suffering and pain. Listen to the void. <laughs> Do you not hear its cries? It calls for blood and bone and flesh. And we shall deliver what it desires. Hope why are you dying? <laughs> Who's attacking me? <laughs> anyway, the time to feed the void is now. It shall turn the tides of our luck. The sacrifices shall be made now. Shark beat. Ooh, ah, ah. And another. If I throw booger, does he come back? Or or am I fucked? Like if I throw booger, is it like are, are is it like over for me? <laughs> Brothers and sisters <laughs> once again. A booger will come back? Okay. Alright, okay, okay. Alright. The void has been sated! And, and I guess I'm throwing myself in there too. Well, crap. <laughs> oh my god, I can't with this song. It's killing me. <laughs> okay. Crap. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, let me put that back on what it needs to be on, which is first obtained. All right, good. <sighs> Oh 
my goodness. Okay, retry. There we go. Um, <laughs> sisters and brothers, we feed the boy now. The ritual was too much. He fainted. <laughs> she preemptively died. Is the mambo killing us? I think it was the mambo that did it. I think it was the mambo that killed us. Um, <laughs> little bit of sacrifice. Tim Tabby conducting human sacrifices. Oh, oh Tabby, what the frick are you doing? <laughs> and the final sacrifice will occur in 10 seconds. A little bit of sacrifice is all we need. Booger returns you were poisoned by spiders. Shit. I already did the gas this gaslight joke. Thank you for feeding the void. <laughs> I'll equip this real quick. Oh, thank you. Oh my gosh. Oh, I put a, probably should have picked restart from last checkpoint. Can I... Can I reload? Will it let me reload? Return to last checkpoint. Yeah, let's do that. I want to change some stuff around. Oh, listen, I hate being the bearer of bad news, but considers kidnapping romantic, being <laughs> remorseless warmonger, and sending loyal acolytes to be killed in some pagan rituals, writing my immortal and listening to Mambo number five. The evidence is piling up. What does the evidence point to? What what does the evidence point to, I wonder? What sort of crimes could I could I be um what sort of profile does this fit? All right, hold. Oh no, there's there should be a rock in here somewhere. Yeah, no, he's right next to a rock. All right, let me in the rock. Put put me in the fucking rock. Um. <laughs> oh, why did she throw them in the void? Is she crazy? What the fuck? Nah, I don't understand. There was no reason for it. <laughs> you may hire only two pawns in your party at any time. They can be discharged by speaking with them again. <sighs> God damn it. Okay, listen. I am releasing you. This is better this way. Little do you know that things would have worked out differently uh, if I didn't reload. You may hire again. Yeah, no, I know that I can only rehire two pawns. You told me about that five seconds ago. Yes. All right. Level 11. Level 11 pawns. Uh, we need... We need an archer. Uh, that much is true and there's not many pawns around here is it are there okay ah uh, all right okay okay you come in with me uh enlist yes um <laughs> get spins in celebration rift time oh what do you mean she's totally normal and fine oh rock me give me that feeling <laughs> Okay, I could clip two sacrifices. This Tabby was stalling. The first was beyond my reach. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. We need another fighter. Yes, All right. Sir. Helmet man, you're coming with me. I am honored to travel with you. you won't be by the time that I'm the by the time that I'm through. You'll be regretting those words. Exit the rift. Good. Um. <laughs> Okay, now that the ritual's complete, and Chapped helped me back as soon as I got in here for an hour straight, I need to sleep. <laughs> You're amazing, I'm a good assistant, and Tabby. Thank you for stopping by, Marcus. I appreciate it. I hope that you sleep well. Uh, you only got the boring pawns because you refused to connect online. Some of the offline pawns can still get pretty wacky. Maybe I should try and connect online. I... St status. Status does not give me the online options. Options would probably give me the online options. <sighs> nah, it's probably like a main... Main title screen sort of thing. Where I have to figure out how to freaking... I'm not pressing the share button. You can't make me. I'm not, I'm not doing that shit. You can summon um... <laughs> Oh, help it, man. You mean Scrotus. <laughs> What's his name? Scrotus? <laughs> oh, okay, his name isn't Scrotus. <laughs> I'm not gonna be like, did I just pick up a pawn named Scrotus? <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I got another fighter to fight for the void as he falls into a large cavern. Now, can we call the next pawn Orreliano? I mean, we could, but we, you'd, everybody would have to suffer me trying to say his name. And suffer we, we would be doing, because I... Ooh, that was painful the first time. Your next pawn named Sacrifice, so at least it's clear for its purpose. Oh, yes. His name's Scrotus. You can ask anybody. Oh, my God. Okay. I didn't know. Excuse me. Oh, my gosh. Uh, okay. So, apparently, his name is really Scrotus. Hey, Scrotus. Scrotus with the helmet. Mr. Scrotum himself. Oh, <laughs> oh you may ask why. Uh, Arleano, because it's an awful Spanish name. Ah, I see, I see. Um, is Arleano a type of cheese? I think it is. Oh yeah, his name is Scrotus from the Tuss family. Mr. Tuss? Mr. Tuss of the Tuss family. Okay, all right, all right, all right. I'm learning so much about our new companion. Just, just tell me what you want. Just tell me what you want. Um, it might just be something similar. Um, uh, so your friend's pawn uh, doesn't cause any RC to hire, no matter no matter how high a level they are. Ah, uh, I see. I see. I see. So it's a nice and easy way to be able to continue to move forward if we get stuck, if I manage to figure out how to connect to the internet. Oh, uh, cheese man, Scrotus. Oh, Mr. Toss, you know what you have to do. <laughs> when is the famous nap stream? Oh, oh yeah, I did promise a nap stream, didn't I? Oh boy. I mean... I mean, today would have probably been the perfect day for it, but I mean, I suppose, I suppose mayhaps sometime later in the week, we could do a nap stream. Saturday might be a good day for a nap stream. Hmm. I'll have to think about this. I'll have to decide what day is optimal for, for nap stream. Oh, uh, wait, true. Taffy, when nap stream? OT stands for the Turkish word Tom. Oh, wait. <laughs> Fish obtained. <laughs> yeah, the reason you're having so much trouble compared to me is because you only have pawns that are the same level as you. Ah, uh, I see. That makes sense. Okay. This makes sense. Ah, crap. Especially since I'm a squishy little mage. I was told I could not sleep until Taffy allowed it during the nap stream. Cruel. <laughs> I know what my next D and Z character is. Uh, Fink Scrotus from the Tuss family. Ooh. Sounds like a very prestigious, prestigious character with a prestigious title. Uh, I don't. Couple of overpowered pawns from friends that made my life a lot easier. Uh huh. Oh, the food is getting roasted. <laughs> yeah, the nap stream. We are not allowed to sleep until we hear Taffy snoring through the mic. <laughs> well, I don't snore, so then y'all are gonna be there a hot minute. Oh, couldn't we just grind levels? We could. We could. We could. We could. Actually, that's a good idea. That's a really good idea. It might be wise to do some side quests and come back later instead of doing whatever it is that I'm currently doing. I was such a scallywag. It's a weird idea overall for a game. It's like an MMO for people who don't want to have to talk to their friends. <laughs> it kind of is, isn't it? It has all of the mechanics, but none of the social aspect. And we just be like waiting for Tabby to let us sleep. <laughs> Someone had to grind to make the higher level pawns for other CUs. Ah, uh, oh yeah, but do you sneeze? You will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
your dedication, waiting for a sneeze, just waiting patiently for the day that I accidentally sneeze on stream. When, what are, what's going to happen when I finally sneeze on stream? Like, I feel like, like I'll be worried for you when I finally sneeze on stream. Because it'll be like you've been waiting for it for so long. And then it'll finally happen. I'll, I'll be concerned on that day. Uh, you can just use my pawn. Should be able to carry you throughout the game. Maybe? I mean, I don't mind level grinding. I super duper don't mind level grinding. Oh, nap stream summary. And this is CG not sleeping. <laughs> you haven't sneezed on stream yet. Weirdly, no. I don't think so. I could have sworn you had sneezed. I wouldn't be surprised if I had, but I I don't know. I know that what I do know is that Bellamy is waiting to hear me sneeze. And they, they have not heard me sneeze yet. Um... <laughs> We'll finally hear the bells of liberation, Tavi. I hope one day Tavi just does a nuke sneeze on the mic and we get deaf. That would be disgusting. That would be so fucking gross. Oh, we could search through older VODs for the sneezes. <laughs> oh my god, that sounds like a horrible task. That sounds like an arduous, terrible task. Um, oh, that sound was that the sound that was promised. Oh, I just imagine. Yes, I imagine it's due to all the mucus. There is a lot of mucus. There is a whole lot of mucus. Oh, baby, Mickey and AI in the screen fonts for sneezes. <laughs> oh, I can't remember what my pawn is called, so I don't know. Add me on Steam or something like that. Okay, okay, okay. That I could do, I suppose. Uh, you mean a sneeze has been recorded through the old VOD. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if I sneezed on a VOD that I that is private. I wouldn't be surprised. Um, oh, but yeah, no, because I was sick once. Um, sick as in sick with a cold once. Oh, the next five sneezes must be unmuted, effective until future streams. <sighs> All right. Okay. Hold on a minute. I need to put that on post-it note. I'm putting it in front of me. Do you accept, Taffy? I do. I do, in fact, accept. Um. Hold on. Okay, don't. Mute. Wow sneezing and then a picture of a stick figure shrugging because i i don't get it i i i don't know why you request this there we go the stick figure is shrugging and let me get some tape oh god where is my tape where tape where for out thou my tape you're not tape i don't know what the fuck you are but you're not tape I long for your sticky embrace, please. I beg of you. Am I dying? Can you fuck off? Whatever the fuck is attacking me, can you fuck off and looking for tape? Okay, I found it. Good. Um, there we go. There we go. There we go. Um. <laughs> oh, that's a good ASMR idea. It's confirmed. The sneeze is real. We are born from the VOD, made by the VOD. Search the sneeze on the old VOD for the god. Lord, and search the sneeze. I hear the bells. I bully you until you add me on Steam. Comforting, relaxing. May glory be to you. Be with you, my hero. I mean, snake. All right, there we go. So that way it doesn't fall. I have tape. I have my please don't mute when you sneeze post-it note. This feels like degeneracy. I think I think this might be some form of degeneracy that I know not know not about. I'm begin I am beginning to suspect that it must be the case. Oh, oh she's destroying half her room for tape. Also, continue sneezes. Still count as one. Okay. Oh. Ah! Oh, that's bullshit. 
shit! It should count as one burst ammunition. <laughs> Sneezing on your followers is definitely some kind of perversion. I think so. I think it counts as as um as one. I believe. Oh, I need to see a picture of all the notes you have on your screen. Your screen is more paper than plastic, I feel. I cleaned up my post-it notes recently because they were getting out of hand. I do have a picture of what it was like at the height of um, the mess on my desk. I, what am I doing? I need to go back. I need to go back. What am I doing? What am I doing? I don't want to be in here. I said that I would leave. I said that I would level grind. It's time for me to level grind. Actually, fuck it. You know what I'll do? Fuck, fuck this shit. Who cares? Return to the last checkpoint. Yes, yes, we go. We do this. We do this. Um. <laughs> okay, good. Um, I have my old pawns again. That's fine. Uh, what level are they though again? What level are you? You're not gonna tell me what level you are. Fuck. Okay. Uh, equipment? If I go to equipment, will you tell me what level you are? 11? 4? They're level 4. That's what I thought. Okay. Um, <laughs> oh crap, I swap out my pawns and, and we level from here. Oh, I need to see- oh right, oh sneeze kink, I mean there's a verb kink, so I'm not surprised. I am not allowing you to slick your way uh, and be lucky with triple sneezes, count as three. Uh, Alright, fine. Fine. First sneezes shall count as one. This is this is tyranny, but I will allow it. I was happy. Where is left and where is right? <laughs> I don't need to know. I don't need to know that. Okay, I don't need to know where left and right is. Okay, knowing where left and right is, that's for squares and nerds. Okay, only nerds can tell their left from the right. And you know what? I don't need to know that. Okay, I'm I'm not I'm not some nerd. I'm not some nerd who wakes up. It's 5 a.m. to play RPGs, you know? I'm I'm not, and... Ma'am, you're coming with me. Um, yeah, so I don't need to know. I don't, I don't fucking need to know where my lefts and my rights are. Oh, and the kiwi bird is more key than crumbs. <laughs> oh no, you cleared the notes. I took a picture of it. I took a picture of it. I need- I would need to edit the picture so that way y'all can't read what the, it says on the notes. But yeah, no, I've got a picture. Um... <laughs> you already cornered the market in, in mucus fans. I'm glad. I'm glad that, you know, mucus, I've got plenty of that. Um, I should put mucus in my- in my tags. So that way everybody else... Who just adores listening to somebody who's just chock full of mucus. You know, they know where to go. They know where to fucking find me. It's right here. My nose stuffed. Mucus in ample supply. Oh, I came back because sleep is hard. Fucking hi, you don't know your left but you're right. Next, let's say you don't know which way is west and which way is east. I don't need to know which way is west and which way is east either. I'm not on a boat. You think my ass is going on a boat? No. I'm not, I'm not on a boat. Why the fuck do I need to know east and west? The only time you need to know that shit is when you're on a boat, okay? <laughs> I just want to expand into the sneeze nectar. Oh, but you are, you literally are, you literally are. Slander lies. Oh wait, you still haven't re-stickied the left right post-it notes. No, I have not. Because you know what? I don't need them. Oh no, she's lost. She doesn't know where left and right is. <laughs> a mucus snake is just a slug. I'm a slug. I've been a slug all along, y'all. A snake covered in mucus is indeed a slug. And let me fucking tell ya. Oh boy, am I covered in mucus. Harpy hunting, bury the dead, 44 undead, that's awful. What a horrible thing to ask. Uh, defeat two ogres. You know what, yeah, I'll take the f I'll take the two ogres. Two is better than 44 fucking zombies, fuck that shit. Oh, bruh! <laughs> Marcus Trevi only knows how to swing a fifth sword and sometimes hit enemies. Do you think the cardinal directions don't apply on land? They don't. They, they don't, okay? On land, you can use up, down, and left and right, okay? And that's all that you need. Oh, and I suppose forward and backward, if you want to get, like, super specific. But, like, east, west, 
We don't need those, okay? When you're on land, they don't apply, okay? <laughs> Passing passage gate. There we go. And the tabby, which direction the sun rises and sets? It rises up and then it goes down. And that's all that I need to know. A great quote. You kiss an ample supply green slimy noodle. Ella. Hey, Bunger. Good afternoon, Bunger. It's good to see you. Oh, uh, imagine Tabby ventures out into the city. She knows the city is east or something like that. But golly, where is east? <laughs> Notes from Tabby. Make sure I don't bring grasshoppers to my bed. Washing hands after bathroom. This is left. This is right. What is... <laughs> so I'm like hitting up the delivery man again. Do biceps. I, yeah, pretty much. You know? That covers all of my post-it notes. Oh boy, am I covered in mucus. It really feels like something that should get you banned. <laughs> It would make my life, it would make my life for like, you know, I wake up tomorrow and I'm like, you've been banned. And, it, you know, I don't think they tell people why they've been banned, honestly. But if it turned out that I had been banned for being, uh, being over here, like, I'm covered in mucus, y'all. Do you want to know how much mucus I'm covered in? Do you want me to describe the mucus that I am covered in? Just being a weird little freak online. <laughs> You know, not even, not even in a sexual way. Just being weird. Just being, just being so weird. Just weirding everybody out. That's what just like, we don't know what the fuck is going on here. But we need it to stop. Oh, I don't know. A cool trick for east and west. Just spell we. West, east. That would, that's an amazing trick, Marcus. If I'm ever on a boat, I'll remember to use it. I can't believe Tabby can follow any directions at all, since we haven't spoke of this earlier. <laughs> Tabby, you're a librarian snake. For thou sake. And you know, in a library, I don't need to know left, right either. Okay, books over there, books over there. That's all that, that's all that I need to know. Okay? There's, there's, you know, the genres, and then there's by the Dewey Decimal System. And that's all that I need. You see, if we could tell directions via the Dewey Decimal System in real life, maybe things would be different. Maybe I would have a better sense of direction. But, you know, we are we as a society are not so lucky. Oh, that doesn't help. <laughs> she doesn't know left from right. <laughs> but you don't know left, right. So we only have up, down, forward, and back. Where are the turns? <laughs> we don't turn. The key is to never turn. The key is to never turn. You just keep walking forward until you're able to, like go around a corner or something um oh what but what is sigma taffy uh what what is sigma i feel like i'm walking into something oh ban reason too much mucus content banned from what the outside <laughs> taffy you're weird bro <laughs> ban reason far too slimy house arrest too goopy too goopy for public too slimy for public my primary school thought <laughs> thought me this neat saying surprisingly never entertain oh for finding carnal directions the teacher was questionable <sighs> sounds questionable but if it works it works oh tappers you're homie and i adore you but you are a mucusy <laughs> total snap <laughs> And you know what? I'm not going to change the amount of mucus that I have in my body, okay? I can't change the amount of mucus I have in my body. We have to live like this, collectively, okay? My mucus is now a group activity now, okay? It's stuck in there, and you have to hear it be stuck in there. Um, oh, Tabby makes cobwebs, and instead of throwing silk, she uses mucus from her nose. Her cobwebs are green, though, sometimes yellow, depending on how much water she drank. After five tequila meals, you go pour it side. Exactly! Bastacina, you get it. You understand. You know exactly, um, how I decide where I need to go. Oh, she really acts what a sigma, guys. Do I tell her? I can't believe it. She doesn't know. <laughs> is this, is this something that I should, that I should know? Oh, Tappers, the bigger numbers are to the right, and the small numbers are to the left. Oh, grats, Dewey Decimal now teaches you right and left. Ah, it's not the same if I can't see the numbers in front of my face. I'm pretty sure Sigma is similar, similar to Legoma. Oh! I see. I see, I see. That makes sense. Huh. 
Um, I'll talk about yes. <laughs> These nuts instead of lingua. Uh, and why are we speaking so much about mucus? Are you guys okay? <laughs> I can't believe she knows about lingma, but not sigma. Oh, I'm 9k runes, by the way. I love that for me. Nice! Sick! Oh, it's so sad that Steve, jo Steve Jobs died from dogma. From dogma, huh? Oh, <laughs> oh dogma dragons. <laughs> hey, the command still works. Nice. Oh, who is, who is Steve Jobs? I think he was like a... I think he was like a famous like construction worker, I think. I think so. I think he was really, really famous for making really good buildings. I think that's what he was famous for. Oh, Taffy? Mm -hmm. You don't know who Steve Jobs is? No, he's the construction worker, guys. <laughs> he's the famous construction worker. <laughs> you know, you know who he is, Steve Jobs. <laughs> because he, he was called Steve Jobs because he did so many construction jobs and it was amazing. <laughs> It's reverence. We need more famous construction workers. We do. We do. We do. We do. <laughs> Unironically, we do. Society would be better if we did. Uh, I lost 9k runes. Autocorrect. Ah. I see. Oh, well, that fucking sucks. Well, that fucking sucks. It was Steve Jobs. Yeah, he reconstructed most of society. <laughs> <laughs> oh, too many famous architects. Not enough famous construction workers. Exactly. And you know where they're the ones who are doing all the all the heavy lifting. It's good that Steve Jobs is definitely famous for his construction work. Yeah, hold him while I throw fire spells at him. Yeah. Putting things on fire is great. Um, oh man. Oh. <laughs> oh. Someone keyed the music teacher's car. Fortunately, the damage seems to be minor. Hey! <laughs> hey, Synopsis. Good morning. It's good to see you. Thank you for the bit. And more importantly, thank you for that fucking amazing pun. It was Steve Jobs did a lot of construction as a welder. I have words with him. I remember that time. Steve Jobs told me, you weld here so I can put some bricks. <laughs> Not enough fame for sewage treatment plant workers. Their jobs may be shit, but it gets better over time. True. Facts. Facts. I'm looking at the time. I'm looking at the time. Oh, a frick. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. Where, where are we at? Where are we at? Perfect. And then... There we go. <laughs> Four minutes? It's fine! Oh, I like that Tabby falls in all the versions, the variations of Ligma. I'm not well versed in the ways of Ligma. Bam! <laughs> Scam, stop stealing! Thief! <laughs> Y'all don't need the extra four minutes. All right, it's fine. Y'all do not need the extra four minutes. Ah, oh, crap. All right, okay. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, ma'am, hold up. <laughs> Pilferer. <laughs> you can't stop me. You can't stop me. I'm above the law. I'm making a run for it. That's not the button that I'm looking for. That is most certainly not the button that I'm looking for. Fuck shit. Oh, the best workers are those who work so well. Their job isn't needed anymore. That's so fucking true. Oh my gosh. Oh, what do you mean we need it? Oh, you don't understand. <laughs> You're sweet. You're so fucking sweet. You can't run from the law. Oh my god. Thank you so much, everybody. Uh, for stopping by and for hanging out, I appreciate it. I'm gonna be back tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm thinking either Dark Souls or perhaps we take a nap tomorrow. Maybe we should take a nap tomorrow. That would be fun. Um, I hope that all of you have an amazing <laughs> rest of your day or rest of your evening. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye!